Hey Wolves, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing another underrated slime review and today I'm also reviewing Slimes Punch. I brought three slimes from them all together and yeah, I think that's it. Let's get into opening it. They did kind of pack this very tightly together. <laughs> but yeah. So they gave some borax, a thank you card, and three sweets as little extras. But all the slimes came nicely bubble wrapped as well. And nothing leaked at all. These were kind of annoying to open, I'm not gonna lie. But at least it protects them. And I would rather they were, you know, protective and annoying to open than unprotective and protected and easy to open. If you get what I mean? In total, I did order three slimes. There's strawberry bubblegum, cereal milk, and cake butter, and every single one is scented as well. So this first slime is called cake butter. It's a buttercream slime scented like cookie dough. And to me, it doesn't smell like cookie dough. It does have a scent and it's quite light. But I don't really know what it smells like, to be honest. It's just like a perfumey like smell, I guess. It's, you know, something like that. So this slime does have some really nice pokes. And it's super soft and has amazing sizzles and bubble pops as well. It does inflate really nice as well. And it's one of those ones that's super easy to deflate as well, which I love. Because you don't have to spend forever trying to deflate it and never find another container. But yeah, it, it, it deflates quite quickly, which is nice. Well, I find it nice anyways. But yeah, it's a soft, very soft slime. Very stretchy. And it's just really nice. It's very spreadable as well. And it's just easy to... It's just easy to use and moldable. Great for playing in your hands or on the table. Yeah, I really, I really like this one. I'll probably give this one a 9 out of 10 because I can't really smell the cookie dough scent, unfortunately. All the slimes came slightly sticky as well, and I didn't think to activate them. So if they're sticky, this is kind of my fault for not activating them. So just a little heads up there that I forgot to mention. So this next slime is called strawberry bubblegum and it's a cloud cream slime scented strawberry bubblegum. It does actually smell really nice of strawberry bubblegum. So I really love that about this slime. So this slime does actually have that bubblegum like feel to it as well. I don't know how to explain it but it does remind me a lot of bubblegum. But this one does have really nice bubble pops, really nice pokes, really nice sizzles as well. And it's just, it's really good. It is very soft and very creamy. It's super easy to stretch, very holdable. Great for like, play, like one handed play or like, how do you say it? Like, you know, when you play with it off a table, like that. And it's good for on a table as well, obviously. But yeah, it inflates so, so much when you inflate it. It's just the most sizzliest, crunchiest slime ever. It's, it's really good. I, re I really like this one. This one gets a 10 out of 10. It's, it's really good.
So this last slime I brought is called cereal milk. It's a snow fizz slime and it's scented marshmallow cupcake. It did come mixed, unfortunately. It was meant to be like half snow fizz, half like a white basic slime and the snow fizz was like a brownish colour and had sprinkles on top. I'll put a picture so you can see obviously. But yeah, it did come mixed, which I didn't mind. <laughs> to be honest, I don't really know what it smells like. Like, you can smell something. But it doesn't smell like marshmallows, and it doesn't smell like cupcakes, and it doesn't smell like anything I've ever smelled. And it's not like a bad scent, it's not like a good scent, it's not like a really nice one or anything, it's just like, it's just weird. I don't know what it is, it's just weird, let's leave it as that. No, this one is super super soft, and it's super crunchy as well. It does inflate nicely, and yeah, it has amazing sizzles too, it's super stretchy. This one is thinner than the other one, so it's a bit more like soupy and stuff. So I'd recommend playing with this one on a table and not, you know, above a table or anything like that, just in case you make a mess. Yeah, this is a really good slime and I'd probably give it a 9 out. this video thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed please like and subscribe for more and i'll leave all my shops and details in the description below and all of their shops and instagrams and all the socials and all that in the description below as well if you enjoyed please make sure to like and subscribe and comment what you want to see next and yeah i'll see you all next time bye